continuing with Project Camaro here. Uh, I ran out of splatter paint and I'm still waiting for it to warm up. So on to another project. Uh, one of them is going to be to restuff the doors. Uh, right now the doors are just a shell and we're going to put all the guts back in them. And one of the components is the door lock assembly, which is what's in my hand here. Uh, I've cleaned that up. There's the one I haven't cleaned up. I mean, you can go nuts with this, but I don't really see any point in going further than this. Uh, it's up to you. Um, I got it clean. I cleaned off all the old grease. Uh, the only part of this that's visible is this catch assembly. And that shows up uh, right in here. Uh, so, it, to me, it's plenty tidy to go back together. I will uh, now re-grease everything that I've gotten all the old grease and crud out of it. Uh, and I just used a, a cheap paintbrush and a, uh, an oil pan and uh, some leftover gasoline from uh, the trimmer. So it, <laughs> it had a little bit of oil in it, which doesn't hurt anything. And then uh, once everything's degreased, then I uh, just give it a squirt with some uh, brake clean. Brake clean's expensive relative to quantity of gasoline, so uh, the gas works just fine to clean things up. Gas, kerosene, any of that stuff if you've got it on hand. So we're going to reassemble this stuff and get it back in the door. It'll be one less thing sitting around and uh, one more thing on the car while we uh, are waiting for paint to come in that I ordered. So a little update here. Uh, one final thought on these door lock assemblies. One thing that often gets overlooked in these restorations is this little cover. Um, these are original and they're in fine shape, so we're going to reuse them. Uh, and then this little clip. So uh, General Motors put this in there uh, so that this wouldn't rattle against the metal part of the door as much. That's what the covering's for, to cut down on that rattle. Same thing with the clip, and there's a little hole to receive that. Uh, in the door so uh, taking good pictures when things come apart so to know where to put some of this type of thing back is important uh, unless you're very familiar with the car and i happen to be very familiar with this uh generation of camaros and firebirds so.